In line with its social responsibilities, the Central Bank continues to engage the Education, Arts and Culture Ministry in the journey of an improved education sector in the future. Held once every two years, the competition aims to expose learners to the subject matter by ensuring financial literacy is obtained, which is key in the decision-making bodies. Speaking at the event, Education, Arts and Culture Deputy Minister Anangi Pondoka noted the valuable contribution of the Central Bank to the education sector, which had changed so many lives of young Namibians. Evidently, by looking at what the bank has invested so far, it becomes obvious that the Bank of Namibia has invested in a number of human development initiatives, some of which are worth noting, like um, the bursary scheme that has enabled Namibians to access higher education. At Tosha, Nordkrenz, Gabriel Tapopi and the Swakopmund Secondary Schools were the last four schools in the competition from over 200 schools that participated countrywide. Learners were pleased to have broadened their knowledge on financial matters affecting the country. It was breathtaking, it was really exciting. All right. I am a guy with a serious face, you might not think I'm happy, but inside I'm exploding right now. It, it was really a good experience to be part of. Bank of Namibia has enabled us to know more about financial literacy and to be able to pass on this, what, what we've learned here at the competition through educating others. Bank of Namibia Corporate Communications Deputy Director Kadembi Redembruka noted the importance of the Central Bank Initiative that aims to accommodate all 14 regions. A lot of the activities are so window focused and we just think about the capital city. But as a responsible corporate player, we felt it's very important for a competition like this to resonate with the masses, to appeal to the conscience and to appeal to the imagination of young people. And I think that's what we did. Etosha walked away with $50,000, Nodres from Rundu took a $30,000, while Swakopmund Secondary School from the coast, which came in third, took a $10,000, with Gabriel Tapopi Secondary School from the north won a printer at fourth place. Salomotenga, NBC News, Finduk.